Hello everyone, and welcome to our Let's Play of Ghost Gate 2. The cabin. No trespassing. Cabin. Keep out. Why does it even tell us it's a cabin? I don't know. So if you dare, please click the box and type your name. Alright. Our name is Dildos. Alright, we'll be. What? How did I get. Hold on, I got cake on my keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> um. Well, my keyboard was hungry. <laughs> I'd rather actually not be Tiltos. Oh, we are not <laughs> Tiltos. Let's see. Uh, <laughs> Michael's taking over. Damn it. Um, yeah, that's... <laughs> oh, we're both trying to tag the same way. <laughs> Uh. You want to be green for short? Yeah. Alright, and put your name and click here. On the trail. Hello, green. This trail leads to the old cabin in the woods. Rumored to be haunted. It is also apparently very dangerous. In this area with mine shafts and rock slides come in place. Be careful, take a look around, and collect evidence of supernatural occurrences. Check the inventory to see what tasks need to be done. So do you figure we're playing the same main character as last time? I mean, I know we got to name this one, but he seems to have the same idea. Of it. Yeah, I think we're still an old grave. Can I, like... Oh, here. Picture of a cross. Photographed another grave. So this is my first one. <laughs> this one is the shape of a cross, but again, no name inscribed. Strange to have graves so close together in such an odd location. Then again, I doubt many people come up here. Let's photograph that weird tree thing over there. Weird tree sculpture. Photographed a weird tree sculpture. Demonic face sculpted from an old dead tree. It's extremely disturbing to look at. It gives me shoulder shivers. It's so disturbing. It disturbs me. Especially my dick. <laughs> old grave. Photographed an old grave. It has no name and markings on it at all except for a date. 1907. It's very, sh it's very strange not to have a name on it. Re even in a remote place like this. Got a crowbar. It'll come in useful. <laughs> yes, this crowbar will come in the most useful. Mm. I'm guessing. Oh, hey, a look shovel. at that. A shovel. It'll be. It'll come in useful too. Maybe someone <laughs> uses it often, so I decided to just leave it here. I'll borrow it for a short while. Might come in useful. Hey. <laughs> Photographed a headstone, it has no name. Perhaps the weather period has eroded it. Those cliffs look dangerous. Mm. Let's use our crowbar on the gate. Oh. Yes. Apparently, that's not the solution in the I game. Metal detector. Oh. Alright. That's interesting. Can I, like, dig up people's graves? <laughs> hmm. I don't know, does it make any beeping noise or anything, or is it just not that I think? I thought it was making a slight noise, but I don't think it was making a metal zender me noise yet. Hmm. Maybe we, but this is metal. Make noise, it's I'm on barbed wire. <laughs> oh. Maybe we have to cross first. Alright, let's put that up. We have a crowbar. No? No? Fine. Uh, Keep it out. They obviously don't want people to enter. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, there they are. The grave. Ignore this. Oh, 1907. Um, Good job. I, thanks. I'm glad I spotted that, but I like the decryption system from last game. Yeah. Oh, that's a six, not a nine. Yeah, it was just. Read all tasks before you move on. Check your inventory. Photograph one orb. And footprints. Okay, well, there's here's orb. footprints. Oh, you missed the orb, though. I'll, I'll just float around this. It, it floated across the screen. I'll take I see another one. We saw some of the other game, too, and I guess didn't realize we were supposed to photograph them because I didn't. I, I thought they were like dust or something. Orb reappear. Douchebag. There it is. That orb, that white thing there. Yes. Well, we captured an orb. 
They're lost souls simply passing through and attracted to the spirits that gather in this place. They are harmless. They are great evidence of supernatural activity. Yeah, I think they just look like dust balls. <laughs> yes. People will take a little. Oh, hey, look at that guy. What? What that... guy? Oh, you didn't see the figure out there with the scythe that appeared for a second. Oh, I was looking at a pile of dirt. <laughs> apparently, that's so much more interesting than a guy with a scythe. Fine then, look at your pile of dirt. I was just thinking I need to dig it up, you know? Uh, hey, no, they're gone. No. Wait, for photographed another orb. Yay, I found a flower. Mm. Old grave. So no name and markings. Person, why aren't you appearing again? Well, there's eroded that too. Dry wood, just what I always wanted. <laughs> yep, this that's exactly what I always wanted too. Obsidian Sphere. You found an Obsidian Sphere. Obsidian is a dark volcanic glass formed with highs that set off by metal detectors. <laughs> I don't formed know. Formed in the outer edges of lava flows. It, oh, it can have a small iron or magnesium content, which is probably what the metal detector is picking up. It is perfectly spherical and highly polished. How strange to find such an item out here in the middle of nowhere. I like Obsidian. It's one yeah, of rocks pretty. in my collection. <clears throat> and cast forth the gates of Obsidian. Oh, wait. No. It's... That should that should have been that should have been Elder Scrolls Five instead of Skyrim. They should have had Elder Scrolls Five Obsidian because people would have been so hyped about the Obsidian, you know. What wouldn't you have been hyped? Um, I don't understand what I was digging up. <laughs> I don't either. That's interesting. Maybe you just don't always find things when you dig things up. I guess. Any other pile of dirt for me, sir? Uh, Here's some dirt. Uh, our person sure loves digging. I found a skull. What the hell is a human skull doing? Is it? Was it? We dug it up. It's in <laughs> your grave. <laughs> I wonder who this once was. Uh, so now we can. Oh, that's the guy I saw before. Come oh. back. Yeah. Come back. <laughs> that's what I was talking about before. Is that shadow? And just hangs about for. Cross what? Better go for another grace Oh. Yeah. Come back, Anoku. Hmm. This is Cosette agrees you should return. Oh, oh there he is. Oh. oh, he was there for a second. Clearly, clearly, he likes to get you when you're off guard. Apparently. Oh, there he is. Decided Anoku. He photographed a possible image of Anoku. He is rumored to be the spirit who inherits this area and watches over the graves. He is often known as the Graveyard Watcher. Okay. Uh, <laughs> it was kind of weird. It's just like this weird shadow guy, but alright. Hey, another one. Oh, there he is again. Another Anoku. Anoku, you dirty whore! Why don't you stand still longer? You pretty much have to be ready to yeah, take pictures of you. The rickety old fence. <laughs> sure is rickety. Oops. No, I can't rip it up. <laughs> take picture? No, it's not interesting. They're not interesting. <laughs> oh, we found an orb. Nice. 
Hey, someone's digging this grave. <laughs> oh, it has the name Green engraved on it. Cool. So we zombies, we got up and we walked off. <laughs> Apparently. Someone's planning on burying us alive later. I, I think someone's planning on burying us alive, but we'll teach them. We'll take a picture of their face and they'd be like, bitch. Shouldn't have done that. Go inside. Oh, oh let's take a picture of him. Let's do it anyways. <laughs> the, no. no uh oh. Fine. The old man. Hello there, Green. You are looking well today. I've been expecting you. I would like you to do some tasks for me. I'm just an old man. I need what? I need <laughs> lots of help these days. Check your inventory for more information. <laughs> Feel free to investigate whatever you like on my land. You can use that. Their metal. How do you know all this stuff? <laughs> metal detector. If you find a spot worth investigating, do all these things for me and come and see me again. I'll let you take a photograph of me. How does that sound, Green? Why not just roughly <laughs> take one now? And why do you have a, my grave on your property? <laughs> yeah. I'll let you take a picture of me, Green. Uh, no thanks, old man. I'm into younger peoples. Diary. It's a Reynolds diary. I should have re I should have a read to see what these people thought of this area. Maybe I could find out a little more of what's been happening here. Mm. Cool. No? Di oh, it's oh. up there. Okay. Diary. Oh, I'm zoomed in. <laughs> more 18th of July, 2007. I'm supposed to be meeting friends at the this old cabin in the woods. Should be awesome. <laughs> Do a little mountain biking and um, knock a few beers around the fire. They rang rang me a few days ago, but I ain't heard from them since. Oh well, I'm sure we'll hook up. Want to read this one? Oh, attempt to 21st of July 2007. Got to the cabin campsite. But the dudes ain't here. Gets they are never on time. I guess I'll set up and do a few rides on my own before they get here. Scout out the ru uh, best scout the best trails. trails. The old gut at the cabin was a right old shit geezer bugger and charged me a lot for a short stay I'll probably piss off without paying oh but he was secretly a ghost and killed you for that strange thing thing <laughs> strange thing oh okay strange thing happened today I went for a ride and found a bike pedal oh that's so weird <laughs> not really strange except for the fact they are one-offs that Mike has fitted he filed grooves into them for some reason, and this pedal was identical. I don't get it. The guys ain't here, but bits of their bikes are. 24th of July, 2007. I'm getting the whole hell, hell out of here. I, got, I wanted to take a leak last night, and I saw some guy. Looks like it says some gay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, just, uh, some guy. <laughs> he was a big bastard. He was in the freaking woods, just standing there, that all ragged so clothes and a, <laughs> and a wide brimmed hat. I crapped myself and hid my tent with my knife in my hand. The place is a. This, this place, place is, is freaky. freaky. I don't. Okay, it doesn't sound that frightening. Or weird. It doesn't right. either, and I was gonna say, not only does that not sound that frightening or weird, but hey, wasn't that the goal? You you crapped yourself. You were, you were going to go take a leak anyways. You know. Yeah. No? No? But apparently not. <laughs> Bed hasn't been slept in for years. The windows are boarded up. Hey, hey, you know? You know? No? Well, I'm taking sure the windows are boarded up. Or those numbers on the wall. No. Mark Scratch into the wall. <sighs> I think we'd want to take a picture of Mark Scratch into the wall. I personally would. You want to photograph all this stuff for evidence, possibly. You know? Let's get a 
can't open the wardrobe. Full <laughs> metal detect you. He does not want to. He doesn't like this house. He's like, no. I'd rather get away from this old man. He gives me the heebie-jeebies. Let's take a picture of that head. Yeah, I keep trying to take a picture of these hunting trophies, and my character is just like, no. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Okay. Um. Oh, there's another a new whatever up near the tree wood area. A uh, little over. Let me get my cursor in there. Yeah, there. Right. Yay! I'm so good at spotting a Noku, guys. Yeah. You wouldn't believe it. I don't know why. I'm generally not like that super observant, but in this game, I'm being like, hey. Thing. Wow, look at this batch is flying into our face. <laughs> My character is as not faced as I was. Yeah. Some personal documents. <laughs> There's fucking more bats like, oh, I'm gonna get you. Uh, and our dad's just like, Psh, you're just bats. I literally couldn't care less. I need to find a scythe? Yeah. And an obsidian blade. There's a weird smell around here. Alright. That is that. The cables are slimy. You can hear a scratching sound. Yep, I wouldn't touch that. Some big cliff with caves in them. Another cave. Growing curve. And more bats. Hmm. What's yes. that? Yes. Oh, <laughs> break in. No? 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 Oh, that was what our crowbar was for last time. You sound very disappointed in that. I, I, I have a crowbar. I need to use it on something other than this. <laughs> you like using the crowbar, don't you? Yeah, I'm breaking into things and getting into things in a solid door. And here's some dirt on stone for some reason. <laughs> Here, you look. It's on. There's holes and... The pinnacle and the door. There's something. Can I take a picture of it? Can I put this in it? Oh. So we need four more obsidian spheres. Uh, five more obsidian spheres. Apparently, we can't take a picture of the pentagram or the door. What's this zooming skull just doing lying around? We'll rub our cursor over the ground just in case the creature says it needs to be inspected. Oh, a pile of dirt. Nice. We're hey, or spirit guy over there. Camera. Yeah. Nice. Sorry about that. I just, I was like, look at this. I wish there was a shortcut button for my camera. That'd be easier. Yeah. I'd, I'd almost consider having it out constantly like you did in the other game, but this one seems to use the other items more often. Than the other game did. Wow. Yeah. Messy. What the hell is this human skull doing just laying here? Yeah. <laughs> Let's uh, take a picture of this. The tents are stained with blood. No? This isn't evidence enough for you? Fine. Is Can we do anything with that bucket over there? It's all moldy and rotted. I tried to like pick up the cups and stuff and catch it once. It smells disgusting here. Okay, I guess let's get out of here. Are all these tents still the same old tent? Fine. Campfire's been lit, hmm, I wonder. Skull. There's an old diary. Sweet. Got a teensy bit, I just wanna make sure I looked in all the tents, cause they all look the same on the inside. <laughs> they do. Oh, wait. Hey, an orb. Yeah. Nice. Mm. Getting good with that camera there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> By the end of this game, you'll be regular. I don't know. You'll be like that girl from Fatal Frame. Alright. Let's look at 
no, that's three. We need two. Let's go. Speaking of which, let's go take pictures of a girl with a snap neck. Dead yeah, girl. That's ghost. Fine. I like photographing those ghosts. <laughs> Oh hey, Rose. Yeah, it looks like a rose, even though it says a poppy. Very worth searching. Now, as much as I appreciate that we don't have to like go all over the place with our metal detector, I don't know how a guy just knows that place is worth searching. I mean, isn't that what a metal detector is for? Yeah. They're sitting here. Sweet. Well, I mean, I'm definitely glad he does, because otherwise we just have the pain of going to crafting. Look at everything with our metal detector. Hey, another orb! Yeah! What a beautiful view. We're not gonna photograph it? <laughs> Apparently our guy's not like our last character, who's probably the same character who wanted to photograph everything, like, you know, pictures and stuff. Another human skull. We're getting really fond of these, and there's another poppy. It looked violent considering you had your shovel out. <laughs> gonna dig up this here poppy. Farm machinery? I mean, do I, I don't wanna do anything with it? We're searching in more detail. Mm. Uh, oh. There's like Yeah. What? Yeah, yeah. Two. Two! Ah, ha, ha, ha. Ha. Three! Three obsidian spheres. Ah, ha, ha, ha. I don't think of that count video you showed me. <laughs> uh, hey, there he is! Oh. Count? Oh, no. No, <laughs> the guy. Right here? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because I really liked, yeah. They call him the Count because he really likes to fuck. Oh no, a little to the left. Sorry. No, not that much. Uh -huh. Little uh more right there. Oh. <laughs> I should always have some fire wood, so you know. Like, <laughs> cool. Let's set it on fire. You got a lighter. Oh, yeah, I do have a lighter. <laughs> um, let's go upstairs and see if that did anything, I guess. Can I take one, anyways? No? I want to. <laughs> it's like. <laughs> No, you can't be a rapist with your pictures. You have to, you have to have people's consent first. Yeah, I don't think he's saying anything yet. I think that was just one of those things that was supposed to do for him. Oh. Gotta really kiss cliffs. <laughs> Got to the kiss. Ooh, it's sad. What? Your next. Okay. No. <laughs> Fine. Uh, hey, an orb. Yeah. That was random. I don't know. I'm guessing that didn't startle you, because I found that odd, but not overly startling. It's like, you're next! Uh, no, uh, no, it didn't really startle me. I just sat here for a couple seconds and wondered if I did it wrong and I was gonna die. Yeah. But, no. Hey, there's the guy again up. Oops. Right. I'll show you after we get this. Back up, uh, oops. No, not fire. Up here. Computer somewhere around here. There. Good job. Thanks. <laughs> I'm not using that toilet. No. <laughs> Let's photograph that toilet that I'm not using. <laughs> oh, why is it closed again? Apparently you won't <laughs> reopen it, but that just seems weird. That does, yeah. Uh, anyways. 
I mean, you know, this certainly still isn't super scary, but I'm enjoying another picture-taking ghost adventure. Yeah, out of out of why, but this seems like the perfect combination of uh, of games because I've enjoyed every game I played this far that involves taking pictures of ghosts. That's like the main focus. I'm like, ah, oh, it's so hyped. All being a ghost photographer. I love I love taking them embarrassing pictures of those ghosts. You know those pictures with the ghosts on the toilet. Ah, oh, those are the best. Uh, let's see. Come on, Obsidian. Yeah! We only need one more. Sweet. Yeah. Though, even though I like this, it just occurred to me, like I think I was saying, um, another thing that makes these games that are taking about, about taking pictures of ghosts less scary, uh, and kind of interesting, uh, though the other one kind of made sense because it was a magic camera, but this one, like, usually ghosts don't show up on photographs, so it's almost a little ironic, too, it sounds like we're just going around with a normal camera, it's just like, oh... Ghosts, ghosts show up on photographs. We have look at all this photographic evidence. You can't, you can't help but believe in ghosts in this universe. You know. Well, I'm sure someone will find some way of saying it's doctored or something. Oh, probably. But you know, it's not. It's not like all those other things where the ghosts are all just blurry. Maybe we should light all the campfires. Oh, I hadn't even thought of that. Good thinking. Well, apparently not. The campfire has not been lit, and we cannot remedy you guys. <laughs> Guess we can finish reading those diaries. Yeah. 20th of October, 1999. We arrived at the cabin for an annual holiday. We usually have a short break at this time every year. To tell... Tell a few. Oh. Tell a few. Oh, it says, looks like it's a Jew. Tell a few <laughs> ghost stories to make the wife and kids scared. Sitting around the campfire is great for family bonding, and fresh air does us all good. The weather is nice, and we are all looking forward to a nice, long, relaxing weekend. Few <laughs> a Jew a Jew ghost stories. <laughs> uh, my love, my wife loves those Jew ghost stories. You know, the girls went for a walk this morning while I did breakfast. And <laughs> I don't know what he means, but that's just, uh, I don't know, interesting in my mind. While I did breakfast, <laughs> oh, uh, girls were away. <laughs> and said they saw some very strange and scary uh, sculptures. Sculptures. I, 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 I was reading, oh, I'm like, they saw some scary alcatures, what, <laughs> uh, in the woods, I'll ask the old man about them when I see him, strange, uh, old, yellow, fellow, seems harmless enough, but there is a lot of pain in his eyes, who knows what some folks have been through. 35th of October 1999. I asked the old man about the sculptures and he said they had been there since he arrived and that was a very long time ago. I'll take a look myself if I get time. Whoever said camping was relaxing has never been away with my family. Oh well, it's better than work and the view from the lookout point is stunning. 5th, 31st of 19 October 1999. <laughs> Interesting order to read that. <laughs> <laughs> the girls are complaining about the noises at night. They said they can hear voices whispering things. Things that are scaring them. I'm not sure it's if yeah. this is just some kids messing about or something more. I have notified a lot of girls. <laughs> 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 I have notified a lot of girls <laughs> up here. <laughs> and <laughs> and it's kind of spooky. Oh well. <laughs> notifying those graves is pretty spooky. <laughs> oh well. Just one more day and we're going home.
18th of July, 2007. I'm supposed to be meeting friends at this old cabin in the woods. Should be awesome. Do a little, wait. No. We read that one? Yeah. Okay. 13th, we're reading them backwards. Thir 13th of April, 2009. I have found a great little campsite. Very. This person writes like my father. All capitals. I found a great little campsite. Very quiet. And like literally, this matches his handwriting. Exactly. And the old man who runs it seems really nice. I think I'll pitch my tent, get some guns, go on, go, get some grub, grub on the Barbie, and watch the sunset over lookout point tonight. Excuse my writing, it's been a very long day. No. Oh, you know those Barbies, they just love having grub on them. They're like, oh, Ken, feels so good. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, 14th April 2009. I couldn't sleep last night. I kept hearing strange noises outside my tent. The old man said this place was haunted. So I thought, cool. Well, it wasn't. Just bloody noisy. I'm going to talk to the old man this afternoon. See if I can get any ghost stories out of him. There are some graves around here, maybe. I'll ask him about those. <laughs> he told me this place is haunted. Cool! 15th of April 2009. I asked the old man about the graves. Big mistake. He went mad at me, uttering curses under his breath and shouting a name at me. Anoku. He kept shouting it. I finally calmed him down, but he told me I couldn't stay any longer. I asked if I could stay one more night, and he reluctantly agreed. You can't stay any longer. Can I just <laughs> stay one more night? Okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, 16th of April, 2009. I saw something last night in the woods. I can't describe it. But it looked like a man, only very tall, about seven or eight foot, with tattered clothes and a wide-brimmed hat. It was only for an instant, but it was like someone had walked over my grave. I'm out of here as soon as possible. Why would you- Yeah, it was like someone walked over my grave. Clearly, you're not dead in a grave, and even if you were, you wouldn't know how that felt anyway. I don't understand that. <laughs> I, I don't understand it either. It felt like someone walked over my grave that does exist. Uh... So let's see, there's one more diary. An obsidian blade. A bottle of red wine. Four diaries, eight oil lamps, eight skulls. So we need one more skull. Two more oil lamps. One diary. Get in there. Yep. So that begs the question, do you think we should uh, do another part for this, or do you think there's just enough, um... Well, do you think? Let's try and fit it on one, and if it gets too long, we'll just cut it in half. If we have to. Unless you want to try to do another part, we can just tack them together if it's too short. Um... My gut's telling me to, to do another part. Okay. So, sorry if I'm wrong. Um, and remember, kids, if you see a ghost, take a picture of it. I post on the internet. Yes. Thank you for watching, everypony and everyone, and we'll see you all next time. See you next time.